Hi, this is Kurt Ramirez. Today is September 10th, 2017, and I'm in Long Beach, California. I have here an EMF meter, which measures microwave radiation from cell phone towers. As you can see, the level here is 7.8, roughly. And I have a chart here put together by emwatch.com which shows a 7.8 falls in the light green category, the number two. And that's pretty safe. Small risk of serious health effects. So 7.8 is pretty safe. Oh, let me point out that according to emwatch.com, anything over 300 is not safe. There's a high risk of serious health effects. And they used studies to put together this, this chart. The FCC, however, will disagree with this and say everything here is safe. Even over 300 is safe. I'm going to drive the vehicle around the corner to demonstrate something. I'll try to keep the camera on the device, on the instrument. It's a Sunday evening, people are going for a walk. I'm going to turn the corner right here and I'll try to keep the camera on. As you can see the numbers are starting to go up. 500. Okay, there's a car behind me. Let me put on my hazard. Let it pass. So right here, it's over a thousand millivolts per meter. And let me show you why. I'll zoom in. And there's a cell phone tower on top of that restaurant. Which is why the levels went up on this EMF meter. My point in doing this video is to show you that microwave radiation is real. You can buy these instruments online. I got this one through Amazon. And this one is what emwatch.com recommends. It's very accurate. And the lowest I've ever seen is a 6. 6.0 millivolts per meter. I saw a 6 at the Irvine Ranch Conservancy several years ago, which is a big piece of open land. And I saw a 6 a couple of years ago in Avalon, way up high at the Succulent Gardens, where there's no cell phone coverage. However, recently they put up a cell phone tower up there and now the levels are much higher. Um, research shows that when a cell phone tower goes up in a neighborhood, so do the cancer rates. But once again, the FCC says anything over a thousand is safe and there's no problem with any of the cell phone towers. But many disagree with this and uh, the debate the debate continues thanks for watching